Well, we all know the streets of New York are dirty, but just how much of those germs are we really carrying into our homes? CBS 2's Doug Williams with a look at the one thing we should all be doing before going inside. Shoes off, please. It's a dreaded phrase for many house guests, but it's exactly what Professor Alessandra Larry says hosts should demand. The most novel thing about our study is that people are tracking these things indoors on their shoe soles. Dr. Larry co-authored a recent study about contaminants on Manhattan sidewalks, specifically in any standing water. The study focused on the Upper East Side where her office and lab are here at Marymount Manhattan College. We found astonishing levels of enterococci, which are a fecal indicator bacterium. Translated into English, once you walk in your front door, your shoes can be dangerous. 30,000 bacterial cells per 100 milliliter of water. The EPA will has a benchmark that cities use to close beaches, and that benchmark is 110 cells per 100 milliliters of water. My friend Coy here, by all accounts, like all dogs in New York, is a very good boy. The problem is dogs in the city are part of a growing problem on our streets and on our sidewalks. In Coy's defense, dogs are an easy target for blame in this study, but the ideas you may be conjuring up in your head weren't the types of messy sidewalks that were studied. We look for puddles where there's no evidence of feces, no residue, so they appear to be on sidewalks, surfaces that are not fouled. Some of the bacteria found on our sidewalks can cause heart disease, and unsurprisingly, E. coli was also found. As for solutions, cleaner streets would help, but the best way to avoid this is by starting a new habit, if you haven't already. The easiest thing you can do to avoid tracking it into your home is to remove your shoes at the doorway and leave them there. On the Upper East Side, Doug Williams, CBS 2 News. I thought she was going to say stay home. <laughs> that too, I guess. That's the easiest thing you can do. <laughs> Sanitation department says it remains dedicated to keeping the city clean, but is reminding pet owners they are required by law to pick up mm. after their dogs. That doesn't always happen, though, no, does it? it really doesn't. Mm -mm.